Hello friends, it is Prajul Patak this side and you are watching my YouTube channel PyGuru. Friends, in the previous tutorial of this series, we learned how to merge and split PDFs. Moving further, in this video, we are going to learn three new things. Uh, the first one is how to open a password protected PDF file. Then we'll learn how to remove that particular password from the PDF. And then finally, we'll learn how to encrypt a PDF file with a password. Okay. So there are three things that we'll be learning. So let's get started one by one. We'll be doing uh, all of three. So the first thing that we are going to do is uh, how to uh, we'll be we'll learning how to open a password protected PDF file. Now see here uh, in the folder where I have saved my script, I have a PDF file called protected. Okay. So if I open it, it will currently open in Adobe Acrobat DC and it will ask me for a password. So let it just get open and then let me just show you. See here. Uh, so see it's asking for a password so if i enter uh, its password is one two three four five six uh, and if i uh, press ok then only it's going to open see now it's opening ok so it's a password protected file so what we are going to do we are going to read a password protected file using the pyme pdf package and python so how to do it first of all we'll be building a function we'll be creating a simple function which will, uh, we will name it is encrypted so basically this function will check whether a file is encrypted or not encrypted with a password or not and after that we are going to create a variable called pdf and we are just going to open the uh, file here see this time we'll be opening the pdf file using the document method and not the open method okay so here we just have to pass the file name uh, inside the document uh, we have already learned how to open a pdf file using the open method but this time we are opening it using the document method and then finally we will return uh, pdf dot is encrypted ok this is a statement or which you can return to check uh, whether the pdf file is encrypted with the password or not and then uh, let's create a variable called file here. We'll store the file name. So first of all, let me just uh, uh, Type this name Ruskin mode dust on the mountain dot PDF. It's a file in the folder. See here. It's the file uh, If the file is in some other folder you have to pass the full path of the file and then we are just simply going to check if this file is uh, password protected or not so is encrypted and here I'll pass the file name so let me just run this program and let's see if this is password protected or not so it should give me false because uh, I have an error here as encrypted uh, actually it's a spelling mistake so encrypted so let me just run this and see we are getting a false this means this file is not protected with a password okay but this uh, now let me just change the file name and type protected.pdf so let me just run it and let's see if this file is password protected or not see we are getting a true this means that this particular file that i have already shown you is password protected so what we are going to do we are going to remove uh, first of all read this uh, pdf file using uh, by entering the password so see we are using an if condition here if is encrypted file if it means that if the file is password protected then we are going to ask the user password okay so password equals input enter pdf password and then uh, see here this uh, the pdf that we have opened is inside a function so its scope is not outside this function so here we have to again open the file okay so what we can do here we can do this thing pdf uh, wait a minute here we can do this thing pdf equals uh, fids dot open this time we'll be opening the open uh, opening the PDF file using the open method. Okay, why here we have opened using the document method uh, document method because it has this particular statement dot, dot is encrypted. Okay, this thing is not available in the open method. That's why we have to open it using the document method. Here again you have to simplify the file name, and here we are again going to use a if condition called if pdf dot authenticate okay this is uh, another method to uh, check if the password the user has entered is correct or not okay so authenticate and here we'll pass the password that the user has just entered 
password okay so if period of the authenticate password so we are what we are going to do if the password is correct then we are just going to load a page and read it content okay so let's create a variable called page so pdf dot uh, we have already learned how to extract text from a, a pdf page so it's very easy pdf dot load page here just pass the page number so i'll pass one which means the second page because we already know the uh, indexing in pi mu pdf starts from zero okay so what we are going to do we are just going to print the content of the page so page dot get text and here we have to pass text which means we want to read its page text okay else what we are going to do we are simply going to print else print incorrect password okay so let's just run this program and see first of all this file is password protected we already know we have previously checked and now it's asking for a uh, password so if i just uh, type one two three four and press enter uh, it will say incorrect password because it is incorrect so let us just again run this program and this time we'll uh, enter the correct password one two three four five six and if i press enter it's saying that great storage for children basically is the uh, content uh, text written on the second page okay you can just check it and this is how you can uh, read a password protected of pdf but remember you can only read the file uh, pdf content inside this if condition okay and yep now this uh, this is how you can read a password protected pdf file now the second thing that we are going to learn how to decrypt pdf file means how can we remove this particular pdf password so it's very easy just uh, you have to write the same program till here and inside of ins instead of these two lines we are going to write another line so it's very easy we have to just do this pdf dot save okay we will give some another name uh, unprotected dot pdf okay uh, as simple as this you have to do nothing uh, if you want to remove this password just type this pdf dot save and give some another uh, for pdf name okay so it will remove this password so if i just run this program okay so it's asking for the password so one two three four five six and if i press enter uh, it will create another pdf see here another pdf is generated unprotected and this will have no password in it okay uh, let me just open it uh, actually my system is a little slow that's why it's taking time but see here see now this time it didn't ask a password okay so this is how you can remove passwords from a pdf file so uh, i hope you learned these two things how to open password protected files and how to decrypt pdf file the next thing that we are going to learn is how to encrypt a pdf file so let me just uh, comment all these things and let me also delete this file protected dot pdf and unprotected dot pdf because we are going to create another new pdf okay so here first of all uh, we are going to create a function called def encrypt uh, pdf uh, this will take three things a pdf remember not a file name but a pdf and then a password and then the file name by which you want to save it okay so here uh, you have to pass few parameters so i have already written them so that i do not have to write them back so let me just copy it and paste it here yes looks good and uh, let me just explain you what all these things are so this uh, th this thing is known as permissions okay what are the permissions that you want to apply while protecting the pdf or while encrypting the pdf so in, uh, it's an int okay class and it takes uh, four things you can pass here field dot pdf permission accessibility it means that anyone should be able to access the pdf so always you have to use this then fields dot pdf permit, uh, permit print okay so if you want to make your pdf printable you have to type this thing okay and then p fields dot pdf permit copy 
so if you want to uh, if you want that someone should be able to copy the text or anything from it uh, you should pass this particular parameter and then here fish dot pdf permit annotate if you want to that someone should be able to use annotations you should pass this parameter okay inside this int okay so int class you have to pass these four parameters okay uh, this is a per variable okay now the next thing is uh, encryption method so this is another variable encrypt underscore method and its value should be fish dot pdf encrypt aes256 now aes256 is quite a strong algorithm for encrypting files so you should simply use it okay the next thing that we are going to do is pdf dot uh, i think save pdf dot save uh, first of all you have to pass here the out file by the name uh, by which you want to save your pdf file then you have to pass the encryption method uh, encryption so we will simply pass encrypt method variable so encrypt method variable we have simply passed it the next thing uh, is user password remember user pw is the uh, parameter name for which you want to pass the password okay argument and we have to pass one more parameter here and that is permissions so let me just type it and it should be equal to perm okay that we have just created here okay so we have uh, to when the function is taking three arguments a pdf file a password and an output file and then finally we are saving it pdf by the new name that is out file encryption method is aes256 user password is the password that the user will give while calling this function and permissions are all these four okay so this is your function definition and now we are just going to call the function so let's see how can i do it so first of all i am going to create a variable called file and here i will simply take a file name so i have already a file output of pdf okay it's currently it has no password so i'm just going to apply a password on it okay so how to do it it's very easy um, but before that we are going to create a pdf so pdf equals fits dot open and here we are just going to pass the file and then we will call our function so uh, pdf encrypt or encrypt pdf function and we have to pass three things first a pdf so we'll simply pass the pdf we have already created it okay remember not the file name but the pdf then the password so i pa i want password to be one two three four five six seven eight okay and then out file by which you want to save a file so suppose i want to uh, save it by this thing protected document doc dot pdf okay so let me just run this program and let's see if this is password protected or not so we have some error here indentation error so let me just check it where is this indentation error I think I think I think we have some errors. Uh, let me just remove this. Let me just run this program and once again. Again, we are getting this error on the line 69. Line 69. Oops, actually, uh, this thing uh, I forgot to comment it. So let me just run this program once again, and this time it should. Uh, put the password okay so this is here we have got the new pdf protected doc so let me just run this and let's see what happens uh, now if i open it in adobe acrobat acrobat it will ask for a password so see here so it's asking for a password and the password is one two three four five six seven eight and if i now type okay then only the pdf will open otherwise not okay so pdf is opening okay so this is how you can encrypt a pdf file decrypt a pdf file or read a password protected file okay so this is it for this video guys hope you learn something new if you love this video leave a like or a dislike if you are new to my channel subscribe it thank you see you in the next video